What's up everyone, Saints fan, I'm back again with another episode of Fashion Friday, a series where I get to showcase some amazing outfits that you guys submit in GTA Online. And if you have your own outfit you want to submit, just tweet it with the hashtag SaintsFF on Twitter. This week, this first one, maybe one of my favorites that I've seen in quite some time. I'm definitely going to go into GTA Online and put this outfit in my character rotation. This one is from Cluttit. And it's called Los, Sinet Los Sinestros. Hope I said that right. Probably didn't. Doesn't matter though. Because this thing just looks so cool. And there's two different types or, or variations. You have the one with the mask. And then you have the one with the goggles over here. But this just looks so cool. Going through some of these pictures. I love this color scheme. Especially I like these pictures at nighttime. I think this outfit at nighttime looks phenomenal. But right here, this looks just so good. You have the dark gray with the suit pants, the jacket, the shirt, the tie, everything is dark gray. And then for the helmet or the head part, that is all dark gray with some black in it. You have the two different mask options. I think the one on the right also has maybe something on his ear. I, I can't exactly tell, but it just looks so damn good. And it's so unique, so creative, which I really like. I think this one you can see his eyes actually have the white eye contacts as well. So that's another benefit. And it actually goes with the gun, I just noticed. So if you want a really great looking outfit, then that's unique. Boom. This is this is one. Now two other ones from Cluttit. We have one called Corporal. This one is a nice military style of an outfit, but it's not like your typical modern hardcore heavy duty military outfit this one is i guess a corporal's outfit so going through you can see the gray jacket with the gray pants you have the beret on with the glasses and then the the shirt with the tie underneath but it's a pretty good looking outfit if you maybe want to be a more serious military style of a player and then the third one from him is called the rubik's and it's just a nice and colorful outfit. You can see what you need to make it uh, in some of these pictures. Pretty simple, but you are definitely going to stand out with this outfit. Then we have one from or two from Jessica. This one is called the Queen of Bikes, and it is a badass biker female outfit. Doesn't look like it requires too much. Here's the other picture. Looks really great. And if you like to play role play as a biker person, that's a great outfit. And then the other outfit from her is called Cheeky Fox. And it's just a good casual walking around outfit. You can see you got the shirt, the shorts, the boots, the jacket. Pretty nice looking, especially if you're just walking around. Then we have one from Coisla. This one is Viola de Winter from Saints Row the Third. And this one is a great choice if you are doing a lot of CEO work. It, it just has that sort of look to it. But I kind of dig the all black uh, color scheme with this outfit then we have apothesis now this one is your more traditional military style heavy duty outfit you got the camo all matching and you have the helmet with the mask on so you're gonna do a little glitch to get that working but in the end you know it, it does come out pretty cool looking here's actually you can see what you need to make it we actually have another military outfit this one I think is my favorite of the military outfits it's called the seal and it does require quite a bit but it looks pretty damn good in the military base it does look like you fit in and especially if you have like a hanger up there so you're allowed to go in there that would be pretty cool like a pretty cool outfit to use and you can see him just running around here but I really like the way it came out in that picture then we have Ryan and yeah we've done multiple outfits but it's always great to see people make characters specifically for certain outfits and this one is Keanu Reeves as John Wick. John Wick's outfit it's basically just a suit but it does look awesome and your character does look like John Wick. Next up we have from Color. this one is Alibi from Rainbow Six Siege. If you're looking for a military outfit for your female character this one's a little bit different because I like the color scheme the color scheme is a little bit different than a lot of the other ones that you'll see in the game going through the pictures though i really like that red scarf with everything it looks nice this is what you need to make so again with these military outfits they do require quite a bit but if you want to see a comparison 
this is actually what she looks like in the game and then what she looks like in gta so pretty you know pretty spot on as close as you're gonna get in gta Lita, as always has some pretty good outfits these first two are two versions of a cowgirl outfit pretty basic but it just if you're going for the cowgirl look then obviously that looks great and then here's the other i guess more maybe modern or less country version i i don't know what you would call that and then the other outfit this one's a really awesome one it, it kind of with that bike theme it's not really a biker outfit but it does look good on the bike here and scrolling through some of these pictures i really like that bandana i like the color scheme going on there most of the outfit pretty much all the outfit is a darker tone and then that just sort of pops next one from daniel going back to the biker theme this one you can see what you need to make it is a great looking biker outfit if you're gonna do some some dirty stuff you know like bikers do he's riding on his rusted old bike there going through some of the pictures it is your sort of prototypical biker outfit but that those outfits always look badass then we have valiant this one is just a casual outfit for your female character not too complicated to make and it does come out looking pretty good it's got a nice color scheme nothing too crazy and it is just like the name suggests you know a casual sort of outfit this one from noisy gamers is called the untraced outlaw and i kind of dig outfits that use the trench coat especially I, I like the head part on this one the mask with the glasses i think that looks really cool he actually says how to do the bandana glitch if you were curious and it's pretty simple apparently so if you've been wondering how to do that there you go but obviously right above that is everything you need to make this outfit we have devin with an apocalyptic biker outfit and it's kind of just a regular biker outfit i mean i guess really the only apocalyptic part is the rebreather but this is everything you need worn black shirt and some other stuff but it does look cool then we have amjad with the secure serve special unit and this one is a bit of a different outfit it, it almost <laughs> looks like a villain outfit but i like the black and the red color scheme and it does fit with the securo serve colors because those are also black and red you are gonna have to do a little glitch to get the head part working but once you get that done then everything else is pretty straightforward then we have storm with his los santos noir instead of la noir outfit says you would need the brown suit fedora and the brown uh, shirt some other stuff in the outfits though it does look like a i i guess maybe a, an old school detective i do like how in this picture your guy has like the grumpy look on his face which i think is is fitting and it's really cool to see that but yeah if you're going for an old school detective look then this is a pretty awesome one and then wrapping up this week we have two more we have this one from bay empire this one is tyrese from the fast and furious and it does go really good here with the the vodka but that is tyrese and then some of the other pictures you can see it's a pretty simple outfit but it does look pretty good and then we have x gta assassin with the purple hooligan so if you like purple and black this is a pretty cool outfit that uses those colors so there you guys have it that is this week's episode thank you all for watching please drop the video like if you did enjoy subscribe for more awesome gta content like i said if you have your own outfits you can tweet them with the hashtag saintsff and as always, I will see you guys in the next one.